network in this tutorial i'm going to show you about the uh, installing about the uh, web panel so centos web panel so that is a free web hosting control panel that allow use to easily manage multiple servers for both dedicated and vpns so without the need of this access server through the ssh for every small task that you need to complete so this is a feature rich control panel that i am sure you will love it so i will try to list some of the most beneficial features that are below highlighted here the points are there for the apache web server this is the mode security owsp rules optional are there and php 5.04 this is the version latest version and php switcher and then mysql or with the my php my admin comes and the email like post fix and the deep core mailboxes round cube web interface and the fifth one is your cfs that means configure server firewall and the last one is backup this feature is optional for this one so for this one, seventh one is your free dns server and live monitoring backups file system server configuration and the cpanel account migration so all these 12 points will comes under this uh, uh, web panel centers so this team speaks three manager voice uh, manager video streaming latest version of cwp is 0 0.9.80 uh, it's six is the version which was released recently 19 april and it has been fixed some bugs regarding the improvement of this one so let us begin now minimum requirement you need to have for 32 bit peoples you need to have 512 mb ram if you are using 64 bit server you need to have 1 gb of ram and the hard disk you need both both uh, should be have 10 GB that that means 32 bit and 64 bit people both you need to have 10 GB of hard disk and operating system you can use CentOS 6 Red Hat 6 Cloud Linux also you can use and the website you can see the CentOS web panel .com is the website for this web panel the installation process is this web panel is simply first of all I'm going to log in with the root then we need to set the host name and the domain name after that step 3 is to install the web get if you already have installed means you can skip this step and for the step 4 you need to update it after that we are going to reboot it so then we are going to download the center web panel so this 6 to 8 is the command to download this centos web panel and after that now we are going to ready to access the same panel uh, centos web panel via the browser so any browser you open just typing the ip address and giving the port number and uh, you can access the web panel so let us begin now now on the screen you can see uh, my centos 7 i'm uh, using this 64 bit server now first of all i'm going to log in with the root uh, by typing press, press enter password or oh, me i'm logging with the normal user here but Now I am going to log in here with the root. I press you pass for this root here. Now I have been logging with the root. Now we need to just first installing yum give fun y install get. So this is to install the wet get. Now we need to get it type yum hyphen y up now that's notification update has been completed we need to reboot now log in here directly i'm going to Now, we need to go to the slash cd slash user slash local center. Now, we are going to download this centos web panel here. Get get hyphen http semicolon slash centos web panel. Use slash 
and hyphen we will check the latest version here so press enter here so okay download has been completed 76 kb file has been completed now so you can see the file which we have downloaded cw is the latest file okay let this one now we are going to use sh type cw command now we can see with centos web panels Installation. So we need to uh, manually. So I'm going to enter the MySQL password. Now here we need to be patient. See here for the installation process can take up to 10 to 20 minutes. It can take to complete the installation. Once the installation finishes, we'll see the screen saying that CW installation has been completed. Still is going to be download the mode packages 24 dependencies is going to be download showing the screen.